These images have shocked Georgia. Uniformed guards are shown brutally beating prisoners and it's alleged carrying out sexual assaults. Demonstrators took to the streets to show their disgust. There have long been suspicions of human rights abuses in Georgian prisons. This is not the first fact of uh, you know prison you know torture in prisons. Uh, year after year, there's cases, documented cases, and ombudsman's report about tortured prisoners. Uh, only in last year's report, there are 140 different cases identified of torture or mishandling of prisoners. This is bad timing for the governing party, which faces elections in less than two weeks, and the minister in charge of prisons has now resigned. Today the Georgian public saw uh, material which shows that our uh, prisoners are tortured in Georgian prisons, that they are um, subject to cruelty and they are subject to inhuman and degrading treatment. We call all these, according to the European Convention, torture. And Saakashvili's government is torturing people in Georgian prisons. Georgia's president, Mikhail Saakashvili, says he's shocked and angry and has promised to pursue those responsible. Mr. Saakashvili's government swept to power in a popular revolution eight years ago and clamped down heavily on crime and corruption. But critics say Georgia has now swung to the other extreme, with too much power in the hands of the authorities. Damien McGuinness, BBC News, Tbilisi.